All right, guys. Yeah. So, this goes out to companies like Capcom and Don't Nod and any other game company who's released a digital-only game. What you need to do is you need to bring out physical copies of the games you, you made available for the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and whatever other, whatever other consoles you made them for. And some of the games I'm talking about, and yes, I am going to mention them by name, is the Life is Strange games. This is for Don't Nod. You need to bring out physical copies of those games. And no, I'm not, I'm not talking about the Arcadia Bay collection. No, I'm not talking about that. You need to make a physical copy of Life is Strange... And you also need to fit, make a physical copy of Life is Strange Before the Storm. Mm-hmm. And this one goes out to Capcom. Okay? Capcom. What I'm tell what I'm saying to you is you need to release a physical copy of the Ace Attorney, the Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney trilogy. Which has the first three Ace Attorney games in it. Mm hmm. And you know, maybe have like some sort of like, and if you're interested to know, you can do it kind of like, kind of like what Konami did with the Kalbunga collection. You could have like, I don't know, his, you could have like the hit, you could have like screenshots of, of the various games, or you could try really, or you could try putting game, you know, all the Phoenix Wright games on, like, one disc or something like that. You know, just saying, just saying. Now, 2K Games. This goes out to you. What were you thinking releasing WWE 2K20 in the condition you released it in? Are you, were you kidding me with this? Were you kidding everyone who bought this, bro who bought this broken mess? And let's see what other what other what other companies do I need do I need to either say make a physical release or possibly never to release games ever again. Okay, 2K Games, let me just say this to you here and now, okay? What you need to do is you need to release a physical copy of WWE 2K22. And if you already did let people know if it's available to purchase in stores, okay? Mm-hmm. It's probably a good idea. Cause it might make you guys might make you guys some money. Might make you guys a lot of money. You know, if you release physical copies of these games, because most of these games and the reason why I'm saying this is is because of one because of um because God damn it. Oh. It's because of this. Because of one reason and one reason only. What if, and this is just, this is a humongous what if. What if the rights expire to these games on these, on these platforms? Hmm? And then people can't play these games anymore. Hmm? Yeah, what if these companies are like one day all of a sudden out of nowhere are like, can't play them anymore, because we taken them away from you. Hmm? That's why a physical copy might be a might be a very good idea. Just saying. So if you guys do agree that do agree that com that companies need to release a physical copy of these games, you know, go ahead and let me know your thoughts about it, because that's my thoughts on it. Because if you ask me. Oh, and if some of these companies already have released physical copies of the games, just let me know which ones, and believe me, and I mean, just let me know which ones have been released as physical copies, and that will be, a, and that'll be good information to let me know, okay? So, let me know your thoughts in the, com in the comments down below. Go ahead and, uh, you know, like, you know, like the video if you want to, subscribe, and do all the other shit. You know, I always tell you guys to do. And guys, you take care of yourselves. You be safe. You be careful. 
And guys, if you got if you guys are experiencing cold weather right now, try and stay warm. And guys,